You know, we get to sell some interesting stuff around here. These coins are basically one of those funny, not funny stories. <laughs> it's ultimately what it comes down to. Uh, kind of our loss, your gain. Uh, our loss, your opportunity. Uh, it, it's, a, it's a fairly funny story, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and tell it. About, well, it's been quite a while, because it was pre-COVID. We were at an auction, and we bought a sealed bag of original Franklin half dollars, 1963 Denver Mint. Sealed bag, sewn from the mint, absolutely, positively pristine and pure. Sealed bag paid a small fortune for it because it's been years and years and years since I've seen a sealed bag. And we have been waiting for all of this time to figure out what we were going to do with it. Because they were all sealed, were we going to send them in and have them certified? Because, I mean, higher graded Franklin half dollars. I mean, a Mint State 64 is like a hundred and something dollars. Mint State 67 is like a $2,000 coin. So we're like, okay, we have a sealed bag. Do we just send these in and get them certified and see, you know, what comes out of it? $1,000 face, 2,000 $2, coins. So it's just been sitting basically back in the vault for years. Recently, we were selling, if, if you watch this program, you may be familiar with our uh, Silver Horde, where you, know, you get Franklin half dollars and Walking Liberty half dollars and all this, and one of the guys in the back went into the vault, and he needed Franklin half dollars. And he saw a bag of Franklin half dollars. And he didn't think about the fact that the bag was sealed, that the bag... Our fault. We didn't put a we didn't put a, a, a sticker or a, or a sign or anything on it, and so he just popped it open and started putting them. So I put about fifty coins into the into Silver Hort. I actually went back to the vault and I saw that bag open, and I'm like, so I'm out there like, what happened? And they go, well, we needed Silver Hort, and I go, okay, well, that really wasn't the bag you were supposed to use, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. So now the bag's open. Here, let me show you how it was. So this was the bag, full, full. Of, see, it has said half dollars, the U.S. Denver Mint, half dollars. Do not cut bag when opening. Return to the Denver Mint. It was open across, it was, it was sewed across the top. He opened it up across the top, just like this. And if you'll notice, you see the sewing here? There's just enough room to get your hand in there. Just enough room to get your hand in and grab 50 coins out. So, so anyway, we have now an open bag, original bag, of, uh, of 1963 Denver Minted Franklin half dollars. Happened to be last year of issue, all that uh, was kind of a big deal. So what we decided to do, instead of send it in and have it, uh, and have it certified, we just said, well, why don't we let you guys send it in, get certified if you want, or just keep them. Original, stunning, brilliant, uncirculated coins. So here's what we did. There's 1,950 coins. 50 of them went out in the silver hoard. If you bought one of our silver hoards, look for a, look for a brilliant, uncirculated Franklin half dollar. There's 50 of them floating around out there uh, uh, that was in the silver hoard. Uh, other than that, I got 1,950 coins, as you can see. They're absolutely, positively stunning. They're original bag. They got put into this bag in 1963 at the Denver Mint, and they got opened up about three weeks ago. So <clears throat> here's what we're doing. $39.95 or three for a hundred. So all the way down to $33 a piece. Now, we don't normally do this. These would normally come in rolls or something like that. But these coins, since so many people may want to certify them or just put them away because they're so nice, every coin comes in a flip. Okay, as you can see, one of the plastic holders individually. Because I mean, once we do this, we took these coins out, put them up here, and then they'll all go back into flips that you see uh, uh, with this right here. So that way you can guarantee kind of the highest possible grade. I mean, they're going to be probably, you know, Minstate 62, 63, 64, 65. I don't know how high they're going to go. I mean, there's 2,950 coins out of this deal. I'm looking here, nationally advertised catalog, and they have a 1963 Denver Mint. Uh, the highest they go is almost uncirculated. And their almost uncirculated price here is $46.50 for almost uncirculated. $46.50. There you go. 
for almost uncirculated, if you go up there, about uncirculated 4650. They don't even sell BU coins. They don't even sell BU coins with this. Because BU coins, particularly in the Franklin half dollars, are just basically gone. Most of them are slabbed. You know, 64 sells for what, $200, something like that. So anything that's nice, all original bags, all these original BU coins all get slabbed, all get certified. This is your opportunity to buy coins kind of pre slab pre-certified. You get to get them. Normally, dealers would buy this bag and send them all in and get them certified. I want to show you something here. Uh, I, you know, I just grabbed a couple coins, and I mean, it is just absolutely, I mean, the, I can't even explain to you the luster. Look at that original luster that's on this coin. I mean, that coin is absolutely, positively stunning. It's absolutely, positively stunning. I mean, that one is an absolute blazer right there. All coins, nice, bright white coins that you can see right there that have been in the bag for, what, what is now, uh, 63, so that's 60, 60 years. So they've been in the bag for 60 years, and you can see solid silver, the whole thing. I mean, the melt value on these things is, what, 20 bucks or so, something like that. And I get the pleasure and selling them to you for less than I paid for them. Because all the value, to some degree, to us was the sealed bag part of this, okay? And we would have sent in all these. We would have had 2,000 coins. Uh, you know, we would have sent them into NGC that had done a special label, sealed bag, 1963D. You know, we would have probably sold them for $99. I mean, all of that stuff, well, like I said, it just didn't work out. It got opened up in the back. Uh, that's, oh, by the way, the guy that did it, still working for us, been here a long time. Time. Like I said, one, you know, one, I was going to say one strike, but that's really two strikes in one right there. So, but he's still back there. Like I said, long time, a uh, long time guy. He didn't know. I mean, it was our fault for not labeling the bag. But uh, I just remember going back there and seeing that bag open, just going, oh my goodness. Well, our mistake is your opportunity right here. So you have last year of issue, you have Denver Mint, you've got absolutely stunning, brilliant, uncirculated coins that you see right there. There's only 1,950, so it is absolutely, positively crazy limited. 39.95 in the nationally advertised catalog, 46.50 for a, about almost uncirculated. We are get, I mean, these are absolutely uncirculated, brilliant, uncirculated coins. 39 dollars original bag coins, 39.95. A grade or two or three or five grades higher for 20% less. And you can get three coins. You're down to $33 a coin. $33 a coin if you buy three of them. And remember, because it is so important for the kind of the long-term collector value of these, I'm going to go ahead and pull, pull this down here, guys. Uh, uh, they're going to come in flips so that you can see that right there because you want to protect them. You don't want anything else going wrong with these coins in any way, shape, or form. I put two of them in this flip, and so you can see it, it is just absolutely, positively, every one of these coins are just blazers, bright, I mean, just bright, white, fabulous coins that might be the highest graded, uh, 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 you know, unslab 1963 Franklin, I'm sure it is, that I've ever sold on this program in a quarter century. So great opportunity. Sad for us, glad for you. Like I said, funny, not funny story. But at the end of the day, you, look, you get to do what we do. Find an original bag. You have them certified. You do this. So you get to do this. You don't have to certify them. They're still absolutely positive, uh, positively fantastic coins. Like I said, original blazing white, original brilliant uncirculated coins at less than the about uncirculated price that you see out there at retail. So fabulous price. Great opportunity. Literally once in a, once in a quarter century opportunity. I, don't, I think it's been probably 15, 20 years since I've seen a sealed bag. That's why we paid monster dollars for it at auction, uh, you know, three, four years ago was because it was a sealed bag. So all these out of our original sealed bag, like I said, 1,950 coins, absolutely positively. Every coin comes in, in its own individual flip holder, $39.95, absolutely stunning price. Only way you can get them for less than that is you can buy three. For 100 bucks, you're down to $33.33 per coin. Unique, unique uh, numismatic opportunity for you to put some original gem brilliant uncirculated Franklins in your collection today.